welcome to flipmyproject.com now let me discuss about the title of the process uh, our project title is a securing brokerless bubbles or subscribe systems using int based encryption in this paper we are we are going to propose a um, cryptography method called uh, int based encryption that is similar to the add based encryption methods uh, in this we are uh, um, we are providing the some informations by using publishers to the subscriber without any broker by uh, using securable method called attribute based encryption method uh, this is the main objective of our process now let me discuss about the abstract of our process uh, so in the in our process the pro provision of basic basic security mechanism such as authentication and confidentiality is highly challenging in a content based publish and subscribe system so authentication of publishers and subscribers is difficult to achieve due to the loose coupling of uh, publishers and sub sub subscribers that means there is uh, no authentication or unsecure between the publishers and subscribers so likewise confidentiality of events and subscribe subscriptions conflicts with content based routing so in this paper we present a novel approach to provide confidentiality and authentication in a brokerless content based publish or subscribe system the authentication of publishers and subscribers as well as the confidentiality of events is ensured by adopting the pairing based cryptography mechanisms to the needs of published and subscribe system Furthermore, an algorithm to cluster subscribers according to the subscriptions preserves a weak notion of subscription confidentiality. So, in this paper, our contribution is mainly classified into three procedures. So, use of searchable encryptions to enable efficient routing of encrypted events, multi credential routing, and new event dissemination strategies to strengthen the weak subscription confidentiality and thorough analysis of different attacks on subscription confidentiality so the overall approach provides a fine grain key management and the cost of encryption decryption and routing is in the order of subscribed attributes so moreover the evaluation show that providing security is affordable with respect to the throughput of proposed cryptographic primitives and delays incurred during the conception of publish and subscribe system overlay and the event dissemination this is the uh, concept of overall process now let me discuss about the data flow diagram of our process uh, first our process starts with um, publisher publisher enter into a network for uh, um, going to uh, publish something like uh, so if a publisher enter into a network uh, Publish a sub network uh, to the unit key for uh, uh, individual publishers uh, who they are entered into the public and sub network. After the user enter, uh, sorry, publisher enter into a network, um, <coughs> the server collects the attributes of publisher. Like so if, you are, uh, if the publisher is going to publish the file main, uh, the server uh, collects the file attributes uh, like the uh, uh, file main, file extension, file type, uh, file size like this. Uh, these information are collected by key server based upon the uh, publisher attributes, user attributes, uh, master private key and public key sort generated. So based upon the uh, key, uh, we are going to encrypt the publisher information. After publisher encrypt the information based on the master key, uh, in encrypted information has been stored into a cloud. After the information has been stored into the cloud, when the subscriber enters into the network, a subscriber if a subscriber needs to download the request means, uh, sorry, subscriber uh, publisher information means, um, and just uh, down uh, just subscriber download that information. After uh, down download that information, there are. Uh, that information are viewed in an encrypted form. So, subscriber uh, needs to uh, send some credentials to uh, key server. So, key server send uh, sorry, validate some uh, integrity process. So, after validating the integrity process, uh, key server send the decryption key to the uh, subscriber. After subscriber receives the decryption key, he, will, uh, he or she will uh, uh, publisher information and view the contents of the publisher information uh, and this is the uh, complete data for our, for our process 
now let me discuss about the complete demo of our process here in our process we have uh, four packages like key server subscriber publisher and key broker uh, sorry uh, user information so first we are going to start our process with the form.java so under hierarchy form.java file um, that process will be displayed here here in that uh, we displayed a uh, title of the process just click the frame then publisher into into network name get the IP address of publisher and uh, just register the information of uh, publisher just enter your key uh, sorry password then enter your email password then enter your value mail ID then in insert into a database register into a database after registering we can get your unix id this is your unix id so we want to provide the publisher's unix id so based upon the unix id here we are going to enter the publisher into a network so enter your password and then your unix id then authenticate here we are validating based upon the id unix id and the password and the value will be unique ID and then IP address here IP address is also correct and the unique ID is also correct so that is called valid IP address here after validating the publisher then publisher going to publish the information here going to display a uh, choose any file like uh, excel file document and ppd file text and choose any document file Just click that here, that information will be displayed here and click process. In that, uh, this file attributes, uh, this is the file name, file date, and then file type in uh, by uh, file type. Uh, these are the user attribute information. Then um, get the unique key, just click a uh, generate unique key button and run key server uh, dot java in key server package. Just right click and run the file. Uh, just click a unique key for login this is a unique key for our um, publisher login page then just click the uh, receive user attributes button then click the attributes and the uh, user frame attributes are received in a key generation process based upon this attributes we are going to uh, assign a key process here we are going to assign a key unique for every process so as in key to the corresponding user key as in to the corresponding user then we are going to generate the master keys based on the user attribute this is the key one and the key two then based upon this we are going to uh, um, here we are performing the end operation based upon this here we are going to generate the master key then we are going to uh, again ask to the process by using XR in the process uh, uh, master key generate the master key and uh, get the user attribute key then generate the private key then um, to hash the private key so based upon this we are going to cipher the process here we are going to cipher the process this is the key user data is ciphered then upload into a cloud just click the upload button and run uh, data uploading the java in publish package just right click and run the file just click the user ciphered data here going to file is uploading file uploader in a cloud so just click the url this is the dropbox real time cloud environment so just to copy sorry just to copy the code and go to the brave URL this is the Dropbox real time environment uh, environment here uh, there is a process Next 
to my job what i am to do the uh, after uh, we ent- enter into a top box there is some authentication code will be displayed in the browser authentication code will be displayed in that just click store uh, i have to click the store button here uh, it will display the uh, on authentication code that as and uh, that uh, just copy that authentication code and paste it in the console page after that Just sign if you want to register. If you want to register the user means just enter your uh, ID and enter your password. Then your information will be displayed here. Uh, if there is any uh, uh, wrong invalid email or password means that error will be displayed. and password AP request authentication completed and then uh, one authentication code will be displayed here that authentication code will be copied and paste into a console page in the pins after uh, paste that uh, code into a console Just click the allow button, then just copy the code. And paste here. Your linked account has been displayed here, uh, and then your linked account and then your information will be displayed here. And then uh, get your information here. Uploaded files and like contents will be displayed here. What are the uploaded files and something contents will be displayed here? And then playing time and then uh, something process will be number of bytes an icon name and then file received files has been displayed here so what are the storage items will be displayed here then um, then uh, after the upload uh, the process into a cloud then we are going to uh, use the process subscriber if want to download means just uh, go to the subscriber package and uh, on run subscribe the Java just click the subscribe button and go to the display button just by user request received and then user download request into cloud then receive cipher data <coughs> and, uh, and just response give click response in the cloud uh, package then click the receive cipher data then file transferring file transfer is completed then here we are validating the process here i just click the valid and go to the key server in the key server um, 
t to d greater than then process zero t is not lost uh, if uh, t is not lost uh, then after uh, after uh, you are going to uh, download the process means enter your um, private key if a private key is there you can download your process then click the next process get the throughput and then get average cpu utilization get the computation time of cryptographic process and then resource usage of that process and get uh, uh, evaluate the performance of existing system so that means secure system and unsecure system this is the complete flow of our process thank you for watching